Take it all in. Look at it. It's all brand new. It's all different. We're coming up in the world now, lads. Big new setup. Oh, sure doesn't it look lovely? I don't know what I'm doing yet. I don't know what this setup is supposed to look like yet. Camera angle's different. Background's different. Lighting is different. It's all different. You're different. Did you cut your hair? Your skin's looking great. But even though a lot has changed, still the same old Jacksepticeye channel that we all know and love. So yeah, if you haven't been keeping up with the channel, or you've been living under a rock, or you just don't know what's going on in my personal life, which honestly is fair, because I don't know anything going on in your personal life, but I have moved. I am not in that old house anymore. The last episode of that recording session, I actually don't know what the last video there was. I probably should have done some sort of goodbye video, but this is the hello video. This is our new setup here now. Brand new room, a lot is different about it. My background, as you can see, now has lovely stuff on it. We've got Bloodborne statues, Eileen the Crow and the Hunter. We've got a badass Shadow of the Colossus poster going on in the background. That was a limited edition thing that got sent to me. Um, I have a poster for my tour that I did from Durham. They said they made those for us and it's like a rubberized sort of 3D texture. I have some Dark Souls things. I have a humanitarian award I won from Save the Children. And I've got a Deadpool 2 plate that I got when I interviewed Ryan Reynolds. It's a wonderful background. It's so much nicer than a whiteboard and a padded cell. But I absolutely love this new room. It's a bigger room than I was in before, but the paint on the wall is nicer. I'm on carpet now. It's so much larger than before. I've got some badass like Dark Souls and Bloodborne posters on the wall. I can actually hang stuff on the wall now because I don't have it covered in foam. I do have a little bit of foam around the place and there's some like behind my setup as well to try and mitigate the echo. So nothing's finalized yet. But here we are, new setup, new place. I figured what better way to start off a new zone for recording than to do a meme time. It's been a while since I've recorded. You guys probably haven't noticed this damn thing, but I've been gone for like a week from actually sitting down at my computer and doing anything. It's meme time, it's meme time. Gather all your friends, it's meme time, it's meme time, it's meme time. The only cure for sadness. How cool is that? We've seen this puppet before. God, it's creepy. Could you imagine if I looked like that all the time recording my videos? Don't you dare say that I look like that, okay? The camera's a lot closer to me now. I can actually like grab you and shake you around if I want to. So be careful. These hands aren't just for high-fiving, all right? But that looks so cool. I don't know where half of these memes are from. <laughs> There's two puppets. Normal meme time intro? Nah, 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 nah. Fan made meme time intro. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Sky Warped. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Thank you so much. I also realized that I'm kind of paranoid about yelling in here because it's so much more echoey than what I was used to. I recorded in a very small room and all the walls were covered in foam. Now it's brand new open white space and people can hear me. Oh God, what is this? Jack when he sees a guard in Hitman. <laughs> That is exactly what it is. Wait, what is this from? He's bald, he's wearing a suit, he throws a newspaper, he kills someone with it. That's just Hitman. <laughs> what is this from? Oh, it's Doctor Who. That's the TARDIS behind him. <laughs> it's so perfect. Oh my goodness, it's Strax. For those of you who don't watch Doctor Who, he is like a violent potato man. So obviously he's great. Anyway, Bell of Good Meme. <gasps> Guys. I haven't unpacked my bell yet. Oh no. I <laughs> I don't have anything to dingaling. Shit, just put in the sound. Ding 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 ding. Ding ding bell good meme. There it is. As requested. Yes. <laughs> so good. Oh, putting the award on yourself. There's no greater feeling. Screw patting yourself on the back. No, give yourself a medal. That should be the new one. Look at these two good lads. 
They're so happy <laughs> with each other. <laughs> this is me whenever I eat, I like plug my own coffee. Top of the board in coffee. Goes down smooth and tastes delicious. I'm literally drinking it right now. Wow. Now that's the best cup of coffee I've ever had. Cut cut to the cut to the meme. <laughs> there it is again! A handsome man indeed. Best potato. Oh, cute! <laughs> Guys, did you realize Jack Septicai is taller than Sean McLaughlin? Wow! My mind is blown! What Sean's seeing, what I'm seeing. <laughs> even even on the best internet, uh, you'd be surprised how much the degradation in quality is. Like, even when you're watching something super clear on YouTube, if it looks super clear to you, I'm always astonished by how much the bitrate just crushes anything. Because when I'm recording it here on my screen, and even though I try and retain as much quality as, as I can, it's still so much more blurry than what I actually see while I'm recording. Like, seeing my face up in my own face cam and stuff right now as I'm recording it, and then I watch it back and I'm like, man, this looks like garbage! He uploaded all the videos in 720p. It bothered me a lot because his average quality was 1080p. Maybe their max is higher now? I'll go check. Okay, the max is 1080p now. <laughs> what a roller coaster. Look, a little insider info on how YouTube works. If you upload something, it doesn't process to full HD immediately. I think they changed it recently where it might. But back in the day, you could upload something and publish it, and it would just stay at like 480p or 360p, and then it would go up to 720, and then it would process further, and it would go up to 1080. I think they've delayed the process, and actually, when you publish it now, the earliest you can publish it now, I think it has to be HD. I'm not sure, don't quote me on that. Who do I look like? Susan Majewski? But, I think in pandemic time, they actually brought down the limits, because too many people were using the internet. It's only so much to go around, it's not internet. It's internet. <laughs> 14 year olds. She believed Jack's at the guy. I believe in Steve. <laughs> the song of a generation. <laughs> the song of the people. How many views is that video at? Subscribe. Uh, <laughs> do it. <laughs> it. It plays every time I go to my own channel. Top of the morning, my name is Jack Ninety-five my name is million. Uh, my name is Jack Ninety-five million. I can't wait for somebody in the comments to be like. I'm half of those. <laughs> 95 million is an insane amount. Can we get to 100 million views on All The Way? I think it deserves it. I think it's one of the greater YouTuber songs out there. Even though all I did was record episodes and I didn't actually make any music at all. <laughs> the closest video to it is Five Nights at Freddy's 2 animation with 71 million. And then 36 million. It's a harsh drop off after that, lads. Wow! A tiny little painted man. I painted a tiny Jacksepticeye's portrait, small bean. That's cute. Look at that. How did you do that at all? How are you that talented, huh? Look at- Does she use tiny paintbrushes as well? You did, actually. I can see them in the background. Oh man, that's lovely to look at. Thank you. You can just hang that, like, on the tiniest little picture frame. Did you use a tiny easel to draw it as well? <laughs> I was looking at it, I was reading the caption, I looked at the top picture, I was like, what the hell am I looking at? And then, ha <laughs> ha, poor. <laughs> That's a good one. A good alteration on the meme. Good job. You'll go far. Oh, no. That is so creepy. Which means that it's epic. This is a picture I posted on Instagram. <laughs> I look like a creepy pasta. I look like the rake. What would you do if you saw that coming into your yard, huh? Would you kick it? I would. I'd set it on fire. Actually, I'd probably just run away. The real founding titan. <laughs> This is what the Titans looked like when they were first conceptualized. And I'm not going to say any more than that, because I finished the manga of Attack on Titan, and I can't remember what has been revealed in the anime yet, so we're just going to move on. Excellent art. This is me ringing my bell that I don't have. When second graders find out that there are numbers below zero. <laughs> I love this part of the last video. Robin edited it so well. <laughs> I do remember the first time I heard that there was numbers below zero. I always thought they were just like, making stuff up for freezing temperatures. I didn't realize that that's actually how the numbers worked. Well, for metric units, th the rest of you can just go fuck yourselves, okay? I don't care how your numbers work, because it makes no goddamn sense. Zero is freezing, and everything below that is sub-zero. It just makes so much sense. What do people in America call sub-zero for Mortal Kombat? It's like... <laughs> 
Oh, it's 30 degrees. Oh, it's a scorpion versus 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Well, actually, it'd probably be like 30 degrees Fahrenheit because it's sub-zero, not zero. Either way, it's a joke. When Sean asks us to subscribe, do you have time to talk about our Lord and Savior, Jacksepticeye? Did you know that 40% of people who watch my videos aren't even subscribed? And sometimes YouTube unsubscribes you from a channel because it thinks that it's spam. So go ahead, check to see if you're still subscribed, and if you're not, hit that subscribe button. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Ah! Do you have 90 minutes to talk about the Jacksepticeye How Did We Get Here live show comedy world tour? Now with a hint of top of the morning dark blend midnight oil blend beans? I had to move on from the Coca-Cola one because it wouldn't sponsor me, so I just made my own coffee drink. Energy, baby! Coca-Cola sons of bitches. Top of the morning's better anyway. The pupil of your eye can expand as much as 55% while looking at something you love. Me looking at a new episode of Meme Time. You're damn right! If your eyes aren't expanding while you're watching the Meme Time, lads, I don't know what to tell you. Because it's the only cure for sadness. <laughs> This is great. I love having all my own versions of these memes now that I can just spam people with. Thank you. I, I'm i going to save these and use them at the perfect time. The what? I'm not short. I have to go all the way back here and I'm still too tall for the frame. How Jack angles his camera. How dare you? Look, this desk is five feet off the ground. Watch. Look how tall. Five feet off the ground right now this desk is. I'm absolutely massive! But if I, like... This thing is huge! <laughs> you can see me crouching down. <laughs> oh, that's so cringe! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> me trying to sleep. My sleep paralysis demon at 2am. <laughs> <Hey. laughs> hey! What up? <coughs> what up? <laughs> Dude, I've been having mad sleep paralysis the last, like, couple of weeks. Not since I moved, but right before I moved. Maybe it's because I was stressing out and something had to happen, but I was getting mad sleep paralysis again, like, three times a week. It was awful. I hate it. Somebody said my fucking tinnitus. <laughs> uh, my tinnitus just sounds like, ah! Anime. Netflix adaptation. Yes. I am Jack already. Just hit me up, Netflix. Anytime I have the hair, I have the sword. I'm sure I could get the shoes. That's I'll complete the outfit. That's all I need. Let me be it. Mom, go and play with the neighbor's kid. The neighbor's kid. Dude, the neighbor's kid is epic! He's got a sword and a tattoo. He's got long hair and his own merch. Dude, this neighbor's kid is freaking heckin' dope! I want to hang out with that neighbor's kid. How lucky do you think I am? I get to hang out with myself every day. You guys wish. Yeah, damn, the neighbor's kid got a katana? That's dope. My neighbor's kid had a dog. That was actually pretty sick. Since when did Jack have a katana? <laughs> what the hell happened here? You know what's funny? Felix gave me this sword. So Felix would have had two swords. <laughs> He was like, I don't really want the sword anymore. Do you want it? And I was like, hell yeah, I want a sword. Of course I do. I don't know where it is right now, though. Look, I'm still living out of boxes for some stuff. It's not like the most important thing. You know, the first things that came out of my boxes were computer, monitors, camera, microphone, then the lights, then everything else after that was just, I don't care. As long as I have a setup ready, I'm ready to go. Gaming comes first. Local Irish ninja on the loose. Mr. McCloudline <laughs> has had enough. Lock your doors if you're called Jimmy. Mr. McCloudline. An absolute travesty upon my heritage. When your future grandchildren ask if you want a Corona, beer, war flashbacks. <laughs> that poor company. Like, Corona beer is actually nice and refreshing. Put a little lime in there, it's a great summer beverage. It's not the beer that you drink if you're like, hoo -hoo, I like alcohol. It's more like baby's first beer. It doesn't taste that bad. It doesn't uh, have like the strong beer taste, like a good old stout would, you know, or an IPA. But it's good. I like Coronas on a hot summer day, which is few and far between over here. But I like them. And I'm worried that they've had such a huge 
downturn because of what's happening in the world. No, Corona's beer sales did not suffer from the coronavirus. Oh, dude, epic! And I know that the headline is the full story, so I'm just gonna read that and move on. What I think I would do if someone broke into my house. <laughs> what I would actually do. Bro, same. If someone broke into my house, I'd be like sitting at the door going like, are, are, are they in? Are they, are they in the house? Where are they going? Oh God, are they coming upstairs? And I'd probably just hold the door closed. <laughs> I have a sword and I still wouldn't use it. Or maybe I would. But you know, I'd be afraid that I'd go too hard. I'd be afraid that I'd go to like scare him and I'd end up chopping someone's head off. Then I go to jail and I can't make videos from jail. Credit to Slick Bartender on TikTok for making such a cool Jacksepticeye logo. What? Did you make a Jacksepticeye logo out of ice? Okay, well we can't use this music. That's like coming into my house and offering me sweets and then just shitting all over my floor. Come on, man. That was cool. You know, you can save ice, right? Just put it in the freezer. You'll be fine. I give Jack to get some background vocals. Who knew Sean had such a great tenor voice? Huh? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No. Save me. Save me. Save me. Please. 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 Felix. Call it. Call it, Felix. What the fuck? Yes, 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 yes. Come on, I use my thing. No, me and Toast won't use our meetings. No, 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 no. Please, 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 please. Please, please. Ah! It's Toast and Felix. No. <laughs> Holy crap. How do some of you think up of doing this at all? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. This might be one of my greatest Among Us moments ever. Oh my god, that's amazing. Ryan Narciso? Thank you so much. Absolutely the awards you deserve. Thank you. <laughs> Holy crap. 61k followers. Epic. Go follow. Uh, but 3.6 million views on that. Jesus. Oh, you did one for Ray as well? And Corpse and Saikuno? Yes! <laughs> 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 Holy crap! I would argue that that's better than the one of me. This is so much more musical. How are you so bad? Just for bad. I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. What are you doing? I want this sound. This slaps. I want a whole album. Good job, everybody. Go follow Ryan Narciso on TikTok. Sean, coffee scented candles, his fans. Oh my god! Did you get yours? They sold out in a, in less than a day. So thank you for everybody for buying the candles. It was a really fun idea. I'm glad people liked it. Cause you know when people do an April Fool's joke and then some people are like, oh man, I kind of wish that was real. Cause that's excellent. I was like, well, let's do the joke and the product so we can get the best of both worlds. Maybe we can just Hannah Montana this shit. Jack, you're in the news. Is it wrong if I fill a church with fireworks? Fireworks may have caused church fire. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> whoops. <laughs> In my defense, it looked really cool. I was trying to, I was trying to find hell. And what better place to go than a church? You know, I, I'm assuming they have some sort of like direct connection. Since they uh, talk about each other a lot. Wait, is this a recent thing? I guess I shouldn't really be laughing at this. Wait, was anybody hurt in this? I really hope not. Cause now, oh God, I'm gonna feel off now if anybody was hurt in that. When I realize I am now taller than Jack after watching him for years. <laughs> Short. How dare you, all right? <laughs> uh, why? I, I, why am I getting assaulted all the time on my own subreddit? I just came here to have a good time. It's supposed to be the only cure for sadness, not newfound ways of making me sad. <laughs> Shower bastards. 
Providing you with free entertainment all the time. And this is how you repay me. I see how it is. I'm not short. Look. I told you. It's super tall. This room is actually really small. I'm... I don't know how perspective works. Look, it, I, just because you're probably one of, the, some, one of those freaks that grew like eight feet in a year. I was growing up and everyone was like, you'll get your growth spurt. When I was like 12, I was tiny. I was like four foot. And then I grew like a little bit every year, like a teeny tiny bit, like gradual normal. No growth spurt. It was just like watering a plant. And then some people in my class were shorter than me. And then the next year they came back after the summer holidays. Granted, it's not even a year. It was like four months. And then they came back and they were like 11 feet tall. Absolute freaks of nature. Just turned 17. I feel stronger already. Congrats, Tommy. Congrats. Big man. Happy birthday, influential gamer Tommy. I was going to buy you a gift, but then didn't want to. Ha <laughs> ha! Got him! Local report says uh, influential gamer big man Tommy submitted to hospital for burns. God, that is funny. Absolutely is. For me also, because I don't really care for the boy. I get that a lot of it is, is his age and I'm 37 years old, but still, just the way he comes across, I don't know. Uh, I haven't seen much of him, just a little bit. My daughter has watched, show. my God, what am I reading? Look, Tommy's great. This is a bit of banter. You know, this is what happens when you're from Britain and Ireland. You get this, you have a rapport. That's how we like each other is we make fun of each other. Sarcasm and banter are lost on the masses. It's a very fine art. <laughs> Cutting lettuce, granny. Arthritis! Poor granny, she's gonna have arthritis forever. We're never gonna find out how to cure it or how to help her or even who granny is. But all we know is that she's got arthritis. Kids have crushes. Men have girlfriends. Legends have the love of millions. And granny's got arthritis. <laughs> Good man, Ronnie! I don't know what that all means, but great. Hey guys, Nick Bolton here with the Tack Bones. Designed with the needs of the military in mind. Now Granny can't get her trains. <laughs> oh, Nick. God, you'd sell water to a drowning man. Because you'd probably call it Tack Water and say that the military uses it to actually not drown. Jesus Christ. Nick out here selling hearing aids as some sort of like specialized military equipment. Hey guys, Nick Bolton here with tack paper, designed by the military to give you that extra hard wipe when you've had Taco Bell. When your arthritis medication kicks in and you can finally start knitting again. <laughs> oh my god, these are fucking gold. <laughs> what is this picture? Jesus. That's me when I realize that I can smash the like button. Do it right now! Hulk smash that like button! Granny's arthritis medication kicked that like button! I murdered someone. What did you do? I disliked meme time. This is what I'm saying. Don't be like this guy. Do you want to be like this person? No. Smash like. And you too can be amazing. <laughs> He's probably on death row because that is one of the worst things anyone can do other than saying no to Sean. Uh-huh! Uh-huh! Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Granny's arthritis. A never-ending battle, always running away from it. Like meme time and sadness, just curing it, chasing it off, ducking and diving like, what? Huh, huh? Hard hit moving target, isn't it? <laughs> she can't run like that with arthritis. It's because she doesn't got it yet. It's chasing her. It's in the process. Hi, my name is Granny. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Why? Poor Granny, Scar Trace. What is the original meme to this? What is he saying and why is he getting beaten up? This could also apply. Uh, sadness, meme time. Good template, good template. All right, sweet babies. That does it for the first episode in a brand new house, a brand new place. I hope you guys like the setup. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. I'm so excited to do up this room. I'm so excited I have like a whole VR space over here that I can uh, finally get back into doing those games. I haven't done VR in ages. I really want to get back into it. Um, but yeah, I think the place looks cool. I know you guys can't see most of it, but <laughs> all you guys need to see is my face. But smash like, subscribe, buy the coffee. Those are the three cardinal things that I need you to do every episode of Meme Time. And until next time, Stay not sad. Take it all in. Look at it. I was looking at the wrong place for my camera. Fuck.